How to buy medical marijuana. Medical marijuana is controversial but is gaining traction. Under United States federal law, marijuana is classified as a Schedule I drug, which means it has no medicinal value in treatment. However, several states have legalized marijuana for medical use. In the United States, 18 out of 50 states in Washington, D.C. are now legally selling, distributing, and growing medical marijuana, according to ProCon's website. Canada, Austria, Germany, the Netherlands, Spain, Israel, Italy, Finland, and Portugal have also passed laws so you can legally buy marijuana for medical use. What is medical marijuana? According to Wikipedia, medicinal cannabis refers to the parts of herb cannabis used as a physician recommended form of medicine or herbal therapy. It is also the same marijuana or cannabis as that which is smoked recreationally, but is used to alleviate pain or improve the quality of life in certain patients. Medical marijuana, also referred to as medical cannabis, is known to treat several illnesses such as anxiety, insomnia, severe pain, cancer, side effects of chemotherapy and radiation therapy, eating disorders, multiple sclerosis, Lyme disease, AIDS, and many other ailments. Can I get a prescription for medical marijuana? In states where marijuana is legalized, a patient has to receive a doctor's recommendation in order to buy marijuana for medical purposes. A patient will undergo a complete physical examination first before a recommendation is given and afterwards they will have to apply for their medical marijuana license. Most medical states require proof of residency to be considered a qualified patient for use of marijuana so they can buy it legally. How can I buy medical marijuana? In states where you can buy marijuana for medical use is legal, a patient is entitled to apply for the medical marijuana license to possess or grow marijuana. With this license, the patient is enlisted in their state-run medical marijuana program. This license will give the patient and or their caregiver easy access to buy marijuana legally from dispensaries or grow medicinal marijuana at home. Caregivers can also buy marijuana in behalf of their patients. Where can I purchase medical marijuana? There are different dispensaries all over the United States to buy medical marijuana. Patients present their medical marijuana license and or their doctor's recommendation, as well as a valid identification card for proof of identity. At dispensaries, there are different strains and types of medical marijuana available for patients' needs, and staff members will be able to assist the patient on the right kind of medical marijuana for them. Some patients are recommended by their physician to cultivate certain amounts of medical marijuana and find and purchase clones and seeds that are available in dispensaries. Medical marijuana is also found in capsule forms just like any other over-the-counter or prescribed medicine. Patients often buy medical marijuana through other patients or caregivers that grow, especially if they could not locate a local dispensary. These people are often located in areas where selling marijuana is legal, and they are most likely to sell only the patients living in their local area. There are also support groups who often trade plants and medicine for patients who cannot afford to buy marijuana. These groups are mostly advocacy and nonprofit groups that help other patients who use medical marijuana for treatment. In California, Colorado, New Mexico, Maine, Rhode Island, Montana, and Michigan, pharmacies may sell and buy medicinal marijuana for patients. Pay attention to your state and federal laws. Before you buy medical marijuana, be aware of important state and federal laws that control the use of medical marijuana. Take note that marijuana is still classified as a controlled substance under federal law and it is illegal to cultivate, sell, or distribute cannabis or marijuana. If you live in a state where it is legal, to grow, sell, and buy medical marijuana, 
always be sure to check with local law officials and the state laws. Let us know what you think of today's blog.